UK pub chain JD Weatherspoons needs little introduction. The FTSE 250 company operates just over 845 pubs. In October, it announced a pre-tax loss of £30 million for the year to the end of July, caused by higher energy and labour costs. That followed losses of £155 million the year before, because of the pandemic. Its most recent trading update showed an improvement in first quarter sales to early November, but with business in October slightly slower than expected. Weatherspoons, which has been going since 1979, has over 30 pubs up for sale, most of which are situated close to other Spoons pubs. Net debt in early November had fallen to £745 million from around £900 million at the end of July. Interest costs for the current year are expected to be about £10 million higher. The dividend has been suspended since the pandemic. For investors, Covid shutdowns and disruption have been replaced by rising costs and squeezed finances for its customers. However, the chief executive points to expected positive cash flow in the current year and is cautiously optimistic about prospects. Being a budget chain could work in Weatherspoon's favour, as customers defect from more expensive rivals. An oil price back below $90 a barrel compared to over $120 a barrel just after Russia's invasion of Ukraine may also suggest that cost increases are slowing. Weatherspoon's next trading update is scheduled for the 25th of January.